Hi, I want to teach you how to use Evernote and Skitch to annotate PDFs. This only works on PDFs. First you want to set up Skitch on your iPad. Open the app and go to settings and you will sign in to Evernote from the Skitch app. You will choose the default notebook. I would suggest that you make it your uh, username personal notebook. Once you do that, whenever a teacher or someone gives you a PDF in Evernote, you can do the following. If a teacher wants you to annotate a worksheet or PDF, you will want to first duplicate it from the notebook that it is in and then move it to the notebook that you are either sharing with that teacher or that you will use to show them. Press to open the note with the PDF inside of it and on the right hand side there's three dots and there's a duplicate. Next you will click on the notebook name that it says it is in and move note to whatever notebook you need. After you have it in the proper notebook, you can press and tap to download a PDF. When it opens, you'll see a circle with an A in the top. That is Skitch. So you press on that. Skitch will open the PDF and you'll see tools on the right hand side and you'll see colors on the left hand side. You have a variety of tools to choose from. When you are done writing, or annotating your PDF, you'll want to make sure that you go up and press the Save button. That will put the PDF with all of your annotations into the proper Evernote notebook. You can also annotate PDFs and Skits from all apps. If you have a PDF that someone has mailed to you, you can use Open In and select Skitch. You can also add what's called a web clipper in Safari to annotate a web page in Skitch. So if you're in any web page in Safari on the iPad, press the share button. Look for the three dots on the second row. It's by the printer icon and tap on it. Turn on Skitch. You'll now see the Skitch icon in the share selection when you, which will take a screen grab of the web page you're looking at. The Skitch icon is in line 4 with a circle around it. The screen grab will be in your camera roll and can then be opened in Skitch. Penultimate. Penultimate is also an Evernote app. You can sign in with your Evernote account and it will save anything that you do in Penultimate into the Evernote account. It usually makes a Penultimate notebook and you'll find things there, but you can move them just like I showed you earlier. Sometimes you get a sync error and it says it's unable to sync. You really want to press on view details to find out what's going on. In the case here, there's a September 4th in-class homework that could not be synced. What you want to do is find them and delete them. You can duplicate them before you delete them if you need to keep the note. But if you do not take care of the problem, your Evernote is not being backed up, which could be a huge problem. Follow the instructions on the next slide to solve the problem, or come see me, Mr. Schaefer. To delete a note, you find the note. Do not open the note. Rather, just see it in the list of notes. Press firmly and swipe to the left, which will reveal the three icons. Press the trash can to delete. Then go to the trash notebook and swipe to the left on the note which will reveal erase or restore. You should erase. Anything in your trash is also trying to be synced. The sync issue is a huge one and you really need to take care of it. If you have any questions, come see me.